This year, 91 runners will test themselves in the 120th Boston Marathon and honor the life and legacy of Martin Richard, the youngest victim of the marathon bombing. Those proud runners make up Team MR8. And tonight, Kate Merrill shows us how the money they raise is helping to spread a young boy's message of peace, hope, and pure joy. Everybody excited? Splashing, smiles, and high fives. It's a swim class with a heartwarming mission made possible by the Martin Richard Foundation. I always go in the water and stuff, and it's just like so fun. This is the Challenger Sports Program at the Boys and Girls Club of Dorchester. The goal? To coach and include kids with special needs. Getting to kind of uh, just accept everyone for how they are, it's, it's been pretty cool. He gets to participate in sports at whatever level he's capable of. The kids spend time with their instructors for the first half and the second half is all play. That's when young buddy volunteers jump in and swim right alongside the challenger athletes. And then the buddies really get a better understanding that you know they're not seeing the disability, they're seeing the ability of what they can do. So it's really a great feeling. That is an amazing legacy for a little guy like Martin to have. That legacy motivates Patrick Ryan during his long training runs. This will be his third year running as a member of Team MR8. And to me, I don't think there's a better there's a better cause to be devoting time to. Patrick was Martin's Little League coach. Now he's coaching other young kids through Challenger Sports. And it's not just swimming. The money raised by the Martin Richard Foundation also pays for baseball, soccer, and basketball programs. You're using that, that sign that he made, which said, no more hurting people, peace. And you are putting that forward in ways that you now are bringing kids at organizations where they can play sports where they could never do it before. I feel like Martin Richard would have loved this program and what his family's done to carry on their name really uh, makes this community shine bright. Building self-confidence in the kids. On the last day of the swim team, I think I'm going to try to dive in for and a powerful connection for families. They've created this amazing community where they're accepted for their differences and we're very lucky to be part of it. Team MR8 has raised more than $2 million since they began and when the runners cross the finish line this year, they hope to add another half a million dollars to that total. Kate Merrill, WBZ News.